we have, she just arrived. Thank you to Candy, our foster. And she's absolutely gorgeous. She's about four pounds. They say she was hit by a car. Her eye is in really bad shape. She's probably gonna have to have it removed. They think that her jaw is broken. Um, she's covered in blood, but she does wag her tail. She's very, very tiny. Very super cute. Okay, everybody, um, I just left the vet and got upgraded to um, a specialist, so I'm driving over there. I got the dog very doped up. Um, she's not doing well. Basically, her entire skull exploded into her eyeball, um, so she needs a specialist and a surgeon and a CT scan. I've been quoted roughly $8,000. Um, here she is right now. She's doped up until I can get to the other vet, and then I'm gonna keep her there, sedated, until Monday morning, until the, the bone specialist can get over there and decide if he can do the surgery. Um, she's in really bad shape. I'm kind of besides myself. So what the other vet said that those spots over there is not dried blood. Uh, she was dragged through some wet tar and um, that's what's on her eyeball as well is tar. Um, that's her breathing that you can hear. Okay, we're at the specialist now. Um, it's about a two hour wait. Her meds expire in 30 minutes, so I'm gonna go start healing at least to uh, get her sedated again and we're gonna try and keep her sedated. Good morning, everybody. We are at the vet. It's Sunday and we are visiting Survivor. Um, we came in to check to see how she's doing. Um, she's still congested. She has her meeting with a specialist tomorrow and we will decide if uh, we can proceed with saving her or if other decisions need to be made. Um, we have the dog's best interest at heart here. Um, I've gotten a lot of messages from you guys asking if I'm okay, and the truth is uh, I'm having a very hard time with this case specifically. Um, most of you know that I am a firefighter paramedic, so I am used to seeing a lot of trauma and a lot of things, but the difference is uh, with humans, I'm able to help them. And with the dog, I'm not. I'm kind of helpless and I have to sit back on the sidelines. So um, we're doing the best that we can do. And uh, I really love her and she is amazing. So I'll keep you all updated. Good morning, everybody. Um, I have a survivor update. I just hung up with the specialist. Um, they will be doing her CAT scan at about three o'clock and then heading directly into surgery. They've got her on fluids and heavy medication right now. Um, they are going to be removing her eye entirely along with her zygomatic arch, which is this part of the eye right here, and part of her skull. Look who I've got, Survivor. She's done so well. It's been a rough week for her that she has been discharged, so I officially have her. Um, she is alert. She's doing very, very well. I got about 15 vet techs that chased me out to see about adopting her. She's not up for adoption right now, everybody. Like, we're just chilling out, let her recover. Um, but she's alert, as you guys can see, and looks like we did the right thing. Thank you, everyone, for the support.